On to campaign 2010. Last night, Eyewitness News, the Providence Journal, brought you the first televised gubernatorial debate since the primaries. Democrat Frank Caprio, Independent Lincoln Chafee, Republican John Robitaille, and moderate Ken Block squared off at Roger Williams University. Eyewitness News reporter Walt Buteau joins us now with the details live in the capital city with the Providence Mobile Newsroom. As we've seen on TV and heard on the radio, these candidates are willing to attack each other when they pay for an ad, but that doesn't seem to happen when it comes to a face-to-face -face debate. To help voters better understand who you are. It is still two candidates fighting for name recognition, as in Block and Robitaille, and two perceived frontrunners fighting to break away. I expect to see a little bit more um, fireworks tonight from the, from the two major candidates at least. Governor, I certainly would want to have a lower unemployment than any state in the union. We need a business plan that works for Rhode Island. I would expect towards the end of the campaign, when it gets down to crunch time, they will take their gloves off in live debates and really go after each other, trying to distinguish themselves from one to the other and give the voters a clear choice in the state. And save a he says a slugfest between the top two in the polls could create a crack for Robitaille Block to campaign through. And while we didn't see sparks Wednesday, Fleming says just wait. They have to try to make a difference between the two major candidates at this point in order for one of them to break away. If they don't, we're going to have a very close race all the way up to November 2nd. And that date is now creeping up on us less than four weeks away. Live at the Providence Mobile Newsroom in Providence, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.